I've seen many productions of Swan Lake over the years in different countries, different companies, and ours has a purity about it, it has a quality, has a, and it's, it's not overly long, it's two and a half hours, that includes the intermission, but it gets to really the, the, really the core of what the story is all about. It's, it's the story, it's a love story between uh, Odette and, uh, of course, uh, Siegfried, who is the prince. But it's, it's also, uh, uh, beyond the emotions, you have also this incredible uh, beauty of classical dance. You do, it's all in tutu, so most of the girls wear those long, beautiful, straight tutus. So you see the legs so beautifully, the articulation. And it's about classical dance, and I think classical dance, where at one point perhaps it was considered old-fashioned, has come back on force as a powerful, powerful way of expressing stories. We have a, essentially a new crew that's been with us for about five years, most of them, so it's, it's just so incredible to see that, uh, that quality of dancing and to be interpreted by our artists. So I just love it. There's so much details, there's so much work to be done to make it a classical work, to make it pure and beautiful, and in this way you convey all the emotions that Petipa and Ivanov wanted when they created over a hundred years ago. I always like to say to people, if you've never seen ballet, Swan Lake is a perfect first ballet to come and see. You don't need to understand the language itself, you just need to come, sit back, relax, and really enjoy the incredible amount of uh, pageantry, if you will, but just the simple beauty of watching 24 girls moving together to one beat is absolutely uh, breathtaking.